hello hello seekers welcome back to the channel this reading is for scorpio scorpio today is your day to shine okay shine bright like a diamond also scorpio if it is your very first time here and you've not subscribed to the channel be sure that you have in fact subscribed to the channel and turn on the post notifications so you won't miss any of these uploads now what i forgot to tell you is that this reading if it doesn't resonate to you please do not get hurt Please do not get offended or in your feelings, okay? It only simply means this. The reading today is not for you. But if you come back another day, that one might be because I do upload very often here. Now, if it's your first time here and you have not get subscribed, hit that subscribe for me. I'd appreciate it. And turn on your post notification as well so that you will always be the first ones to be notified each and every single time. That I do upload brand new contents. And I do upload pretty often, right? Now, for all my returning seekers, know that I love you guys so, so, so much. Thank you, my darling Aries, for always having my back. I do see the love that you show, and I embrace all of it. All of it. Now, for those of you that are new here, I do pray here. Prayer is a must on this channel, okay? So, I'm going to get into a quick pray. Um, this is going to be um, a bonus read. So I'm just going to get into a quick pray, pull the energy, see what comes through, and we'll take it from there. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading, using my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share with the ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I do give you all the honor and I do give you all the praise in Jesus' name we pray. Amen, y'all. All right. So, okay, Scorpio, now, this reading is a general reading, okay? It will definitely, definitely not resonate to each and every single one of you. Take from this reading what resonates to your present situation and leave the rest. It could pick up your person's energy past, put on a future person. Even for the cross-watchers who are watching, this one could be for you. Now, if you need a personal reading, please connect with me using the information that you will find in the description part of today's video, that will tell you how to connect with me for a personal reading. Do not type my name in on Instagram because there's someone over there that is pretending to be like me or something, whatever they're pretending to be. But they are scammed a couple of people. And I don't want you guys to get scammed from your hard work and money. I will not contact you for a personal reading. Neither will I contact you in any shape or form for a donation on my channel, okay? Giving a donation is up to you. And having a personal reading is also up to you, okay? All right, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and get um, two angels here to assist me with your reading today, all right? So angels, let's get to work, please. What is your placement here and your number in line um, for Scorpio, please? What is your purpose here and your number placement in line? Thank you, angel. All right, so here we have the Angel of Inspiration, and this will be the 18th angel in line. And then we have the Angel of Learning, and this will be the 19th angel in line. Thank you, angels, for coming through to assist me with this reading for Scorpio. Scorpio, please go ahead and write these um, angels down. On white paper only okay now when you have written those these angels down and their number placement be sure that you write your numbers as well um, place these this angel under your pillow while you see tonight now whatever situation that you're presently dealing with these angels will come in and they will comfort and strengthen you okay and heal your heart or give you whatever it is that you're desiring okay but be sure to put them under your pillow all right while you sleep tonight all right. All right, let me go ahead and pull some messages in here. See what's coming through for you guys. All right, Angel, take what resonates, y'all, because it is a general reading. It could pick up cross watchers' energy, so on and so forth. Okay, all right, Angels, let's tap into the energy, please. Let's tap into the energy, please. Let's tap into the energy, please. What's the message? All 
Okay. All right, Scorpio, here's what's coming through for you. Um, so what I see coming in, okay, is communication, okay? That was the very first card that came through um, is the communication. So I do feel like whatever it is that you're going through right now, there's no communication coming in. Um, this communication is giving me balance. So you're definitely trying to find a balance right now. Angels of inspiration and angels of learning. Communication and balance is your most priority. Now, what I do feel as well, that if someone is either feeling stuck or someone, um, this could be you, this could be whoever you have attached yourself with, but someone is rather stuck now. And I do feel like this communication and this balance has a lot to do with this feeling and this yearning of being stuck in one format, right? Now, what I also see here that's coming through is obstacles. Not just a regular shaker obstacle, but I see you overcoming obstacles, which is an awesome thing for me because it validates to me that even though you're dealing with this right now at present, which is communication and balancing um, and others being stuck or this is you feeling stuck, you're definitely trying to find your way out, how to overcome these obstacles. So some of you need to figure out or to learn how to overcome these obstacles that's coming through. All right, let's see what's coming in now. All right, angels. Tell me more. Tell me more for Scorpio, please. Tell me more. What's the message for Scorpio, please? What's the message? Tell me more, angels. Great. Okay. Okay, Scorpio. So we have a romance that is coming through here, okay? Now, this romance it seems to be one like some this romance feels like is is something that is taken away. Something has been eaten from the inside. Yeah? Now, I do feel like someone is trying to put an end to this because the feeling is not sitting right. So, someone is trying to figure out to figure out how to put an end to this because someone is feeling like they're being eaten from the inside, okay? Um, I do feel like someone is, is, is kind of feeding on someone else's innocence. Maybe someone needs to stand up and speak out and say what it is that this person really truly wants, what it is that you need. This is going to definitely find you the peace that you need, okay? Because peace is what you're yearning for. Peace will find its way here. I do feel like you have to be your own inspiration here. Tell me more, angels. What's the messages here, please? For Scorpio. Tell okay. Any more angels? What's the message? Okay. All right. So, Scorpio, now your patience has already been affected. Now, you've either overweighed your, your patience or you're either trying to find patience to deal with this. Okay. Um, but this patience is having you making sacrifices for some of you, or I do feel like for some of you either it's definitely affected your future moving forward, or it's definitely needing or yearning for you to make preparation for something new here. It's needed. Now, also what you need to know, okay, um, Scorpio, your success is in question here. Now, your success is in question because you're pulling the energy of your success being in question. You're either trying to make pathway here or you're either trying to make forward movements to better yourself. Your success is definitely coming through. This is what you're hearing. You're trying to figure out some things here as far as your money is concerned. There's luck that is coming through with this success, all right? But this luck is giving me loyalty, okay? Um, loyalty... 
is big for you. Now, if you're dealing with your job situation, how you make your money, loyalty is in question. If you're dealing with your person's energy, loyalty is in question. If you have friendships, those loyalties are in question. And family ships are in question. Loyalty is big for you is what I'm feeling, Scorpio. Now, I'm definitely feeling like there's something that you need to be letting go because this loyalty might not be coming in. And it's definitely playing with your luck and your money, okay? Your success. Patience has already been battered here. I do feel like self-respect is needed as well moving forward. Um, I do feel like you might have a fear of being alone or this is what you're presently dealing with at this moment, but your strength is needed here, okay? Now, your strength came in because I see dreams need to be fulfilled here. And if you're not where, if your strength is not where your strength needs to be, then you're going to have problems as far as where your life goes are, okay? Now, I see you being very independent or independence is what you're yearning for. But protecting your energy and asking for protection is where life's journey begins with you, Scorpio. Now, Scorpio, there's definitely times where you feel like you've definitely been burnt and you definitely have been burnt because there's hope and wounds here. Now it's time that you start to rebuild yourself and remain in positive here so that these heals, these wounds could be healed because these wounds has to be healed. It is going to give you the confidence. One of these, when you find a way to make sure these, these wounds, these open wounds has been healed, You'll definitely find your purpose and your confidence here. Your confidence is going to give you the safety that you need. This is all your safety net coming through. Safety, right? Now, this is also what's coming through. You need to know this, all right? It's time that you start tapping into your purification. You need to make sure that your life is in order. So that's calling for manifestation, spiritual side of you. Not just sitting there and praying or saying a prayer from a prayer, word of prayer. You're going to have to separate, definitely separate yourself from seen and unseen, okay? And find a place of peace that you could manifest your personal prayer to a higher power. However it is that you choose to do so. But you're definitely going to have to do that because your life goals and journey and missions and purpose is calling for just that. All right? Now, I'm going to go ahead and pull on this uh, deck here. Now, for some of you, you might want to know um, where you could find this deck. Um, you could purchase this deck um, from B Loves Crystals. She's here on YouTube. You could also find her on Instagram, uh, TikTok, uh, Facebook. Uh, you could just go on eBay to purchase her cards. Okay, cards are very beautiful um, and I love them. All right, I'm sharing it because I love these cards. Okay, I love them. And you will love them too. So go ahead and check her out. V loves Crystal. All right. I'll try to tag her name in my this in my title so you could go over there and support. All right. All right. Let's pull some messages in. Angels, what's the energy here, please? For Scorpio, energy for Scorpio, please. What's the message? Tap it into Scorpio's energy. What is it that I need to share with Scorpio? Angels. What is it that I need to share, please? What's the energy? What's the message? What's the energy? What's the message? Come through. All right, Scorpio. All right, someone is fantasizing about you. I fantasize about growing old with you, where actually is what they're saying here. So I'm going to seriously fantasizing about you. And not only fantasizing about you, but they're fantasizing about growing old with you. Okay? Uh, this could be you. This could go in the reverse because it's a general reading. There's something I think you should know, though. Even though I'm fantasizing about you, I really know, I really do think that there is something that you seriously need to know i have to tell you some things okay i have to share something with you there's something i think that you should know here you need to know that i won't give up on you i'm not going to give up on you because i do have a connection here with you tell me more angels Yeah, 
but even though I won't give up on you I'm so done with all with, with promises broken ones that is broken promises um, tears are falling like rain is what I've been doing these broken promises is having tears fall down my face like rain okay so now what I see what I feel is like someone wants more here tell me more angels Tell me more. What's the message here? All right. Okay. So now someone is, is asking for what they want. Prove to me your love is true. You've said words, broken promises here. I'm done with broken promises. Now it's time that you prove to me that your words, okay, your words that you say from your mouth, prove to me that those words are true because I can't do this anymore. Broken promises isn't getting us anywhere. What is the message here, please? Wow. My angel, you forgot your wings tonight. You've forgotten your wings tonight. So it seems like someone might have came over. Maybe left their heart with someone else. But someone really didn't leave the truth. And the truth is not too far behind. Someone left their wings, but the truth is going to come from that. I feel like the truth is going to come out. Someone left their wings behind. But also the truth will follow behind leaving your wings. See, your wings were meant to stay on your back. To explore the world. But someone chose to leave their wings behind. And now, my angel, you forgot your wings tonight. The truth is not far behind, though. I have some things I have to tell you, but I'm trying to figure out how to tell you is what they're saying. Your person is trying to figure out how to tell you what you need to know. I would do it all over again, okay? My mind tells me to leave. My heart tells me to stay. My heart tells me to stay. Even though I know I shouldn't be doing that. But I think I would do it all over again for love. Someone doesn't want to, to end it. Tell me more, angels. Please send me more. For Scorpio, please. What's the message here? For Scorpio, what's the message? What's the energy? What's the message? What's the energy, please? What's the message? What's the energy? For Scorpio, what's the message? What's the energy? What's the message? What's the energy? Here, what's the message for Scorpio? What's the message for Scorpio? Wow. Where does that leave us? Where does, does that leave the love? Is what someone is saying here. What about us? What about us? Where do we stand? Where does this love go from here? What's going to happen now? I feel the vibes. Our chemistry is real. There's definitely chemistry here between two people. There's definitely chemistry here, but there's definitely secrets here that's not been told. Secrets are coming to the front of the line here. Somebody's about to find something out. All right, angels, let's get these cards together. Angel, angels, 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 angels of inspiration, angels of learning, um, number 18 and 19 in line. What's the clarity, please, on these cards? For Scorpio, please. What's the energy? What's the message here? What's the message, angels? What's the message? What is the message here for Scorpio, please? What's the message? What's the message? What's 
the message? What's the message? What's the message? All right, let's get these cards together, y'all. Because we're going to talk about some things. Angels wanted you to have these cards, and so did I to clarify some things up for you. All right, let's talk about it, y'all. All righty. Okay, all right. Let me take a sip, y'all. I'm thirsty. Your girl is thirsty. All right, so we have here the eight of wands in the reverse, okay? Now, whatever is going on here with this connection, someone is definitely having a hard time um, here, even though there's a lot of love that is attached here, okay? There's, there's a lot of love here, y'all, okay? But this love is what I'm feeling is one that someone is fighting, fighting a battle here. Someone is definitely fighting because there's obstacles here. There's a lot of obstacles that's going on here. Why the need is fighting, okay? This person is fighting because they're trying to get out of a web here. Now, I do see people jumping back in. This could be your energy. This could be their, their energy, but this fool card is here. Someone definitely did not look, did not see that there was nothing there. It was going to fall and fall in a, in a pit. All right. I do see like someone's being very foolish with your heart here. Very foolish with your heart. This could be in the reverse. You're being foolish with your own heart. Who knows? All right. Um, but I do feel like someone is about to jump back into things no matter what. Because there's definitely connections here. Massive connections. All right. Someone is definitely not very smart here. Okay. Moving forward. Now we have here uh, the hermit. In, also in the reverse. Now, I do feel like there's maybe this could be you. Take what resonates. This could be your person. But someone is just in their feelings. I do feel like someone is just kind of picking all the time. Um, trying to find a reason where they, when there's no reason. Or uh, this person sometimes have a tendency to give you mixed signals. One minute, this is what they want. The next minute, this is not what I want. Sometimes I feel like they they don't need anyone. Walking alone, choosing to do that. That was a choice. Now, because that was a choice, okay, um, what happened is this Ten of Cups. And this Ten of Cups did come up in the, in the reverse, right? In the reverse, um, because of this behavior, they chose to end things. They made things, and they might, have not, they might not have said, I'm ending it, but the action, their body language said it all. Uh, the action said it all. So things kind of took a turn and things kind of ended here. Okay. Um, they put an end to the dream. Someone decided to put an end to the dream here. Now, this King of Wands um, in the reverse, this behavior definitely was a cold behavior. They was very cold towards you when they made such a very harsh, sad decision here. Okay. They chose to be very cold and very cold at times on period. Now, what I do see coming into this page of one, this page of one's in the reverse. This has definitely caused a lot of um, anxiety um, for some of you. I do feel this anxiety is being one that um, maybe this person feels like you might have hold them back. Or do you maybe you feel like the person, this person might have held you back. Or some kind of a holdback of some sort, okay? Um, I do feel like you might have heard something, seen something, you know, your intuition kind of told you something was evil about what was going on and why they were cold towards you. But I also feel like there's a decision that has to be made. I feel like this decision time and I feel like one has not been made just yet. I do feel someone being scared here or someone being fearful, all right, of what might happen if one's made this decision. Now, what we do have here is the Ten of Wands in the reverse. Your relationship is falling apart, all right? I do feel like, even if you tried, I feel like some of you really tried, 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 and tried again. 
because they do say if a knot is in a string, patients can untie it. Patients can do anything. I do feel like your patients have already been burned and weighed out. I'm trying to hold things together here in the reverse, but it fell apart either way. Now, what I do see coming through here also, y'all, is this uh, Seven of Swords. Now, I do feel um, this person might have slandered your name some way, shape, or form here. Some kind of a slander. If they didn't, somebody else that's connected to them did. I do see you being slandered here for no reason, okay? Uh, but I do feel like um, you're just ready to move on from it because you, you're you just like a knot in a string here, okay? You're like a knot in a string right now. You're just tired of being sick and tired, okay? You're tired of being sick and tired, Scorpio, is what I'm feeling. Um, I do feel like this person might have given you some good advice, but maybe for right now they need to take their own or you need, maybe you need to take your own advice and moving on to making yourself happy and loved, okay? Uh, but this person is just, they're not, they're not ready for you. Um... And you're ready to move on because you realize now that this person is not ready for you. All right. So what I'm seeing here is the King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles been here. I do feel like this person loves to argue a lot. I see a lot of arguments that's coming in. I see weakness setting in as well. And I do see them being corrupt at times. All right. I have to be careful with an energy such as that. Manifestation is needed because the magician is here. You can do all things great or small. You have a lot of love in your heart to give. And because you have such a powerful love to give, Scorpio, you are a lovable soul. Angels have not forgotten. You can manifest whatever the hell you want to manifest. Good, better, in between, okay? All right, so this person definitely... Oh, excuse me. <laughs> the tower is here. I do feel at one point you're either going to end up ghosting them or if you wait too long, they may end up ghosting you. And they might end up ghosting you without any closure at all. Uh, because this King of Cups is also here in the reverse. They're hiding some things from you. I already picked it up over here. I already picked that up over here that they were hiding their true feelings here. They're hiding their true, true feelings here, okay? They're not telling you at all. They tell you what it is that you need to know, not what you want to hear. Well, let's see. They tell you what you want to hear, not what you want to know. That's it. All right, that do see being celebrated here, and I did pick that up here as well. Some kind of a celebration or that's coming in, an achievement um, with friends and family. Maybe for some of you, you need to reconnect, but I do see also the four of cups here and also in the reverse. I see you moving on. It's time that you move on. You should be moving on um, and just doing you for a change. The lover's card. The lover's card is here. Um, this person here is filled with passion because this passion is so undeniably strong they tend to get in trouble they're tended to get in trouble where they bring temptation in uh they're faced with temptation let's just say i do see them connecting with someone maybe from their past this might have been a twin flame type of a thing or this may have been your twin flame okay but they are connected to someone else that is a karmic one now with this lover's card it did put in the three of wands here um, the three of wands here, this this entire situation has, has caused nothing but a disappointment, okay? Disappointment is how you're feeling here, okay? Um, disappointment to the point of, hmm, someone is still saying I would want to do it all over again, even though you're in disappointment. Wow. Now, this disappointment, just take this, okay? And I have to share this with some of you, all right? Um... They think because of what they have done to you, some of you are in separation right now, but because of what they have done, they might think, or they are thinking that you might have found someone else, okay? I do feel like they think you have moved on, okay? Um, this relationship at this point right now, as we presently speak, I do feel this relationship is feeling like one of a long distance type of a thing. But I do feel someone is maybe waiting. This could be you still waiting with all the red flags. Or this could be your person waiting because they know that they could go back and forth and have a place in your heart no matter what. Okay. But the decision has to be made and it is the decision time. This three of wands is representing it. It's time to make a damn decision. Don't make a choice anymore because the choices that you have made did not work. It backfired. Now it's that you make a choice. And walk away from it, okay? It is time. Clock is ticking. 
that is your reading for today. I hope it resonates with you. Please don't forget to pray because prayer does work. Um, if you do need to have a um, prayer, um, specific prayer request, go ahead and put that in your initials in the comment section of this video. Uh, if you do need prayer for your person, do the same for them. If you need prayer for a friend or a family member, do that for them as well. Pray for me. I'll be praying for you always. And with that said, always remember to seek first and you will always find.